Hi, I'm Dr. Kurt Wooler from LabTestPlus.com. If sleep issues are a problem for you, then it's certainly worthwhile doing some testing to see what may be the problem. One of the first things I do for people with sleep issues is to look at their adrenal profile. Uh, because if cortisols are imbalanced, that can be a trigger of issues related to sleep. Could be blood sugar problems or maybe some kind of chronic infection, some type of stressor that is interfering with your ability to sleep. Also, the evaluation of sex hormones. Progesterone deficiencies can often lead to sleep problems, as well as melatonin deficiencies. And those can all be correlated with the 205, the functional adrenal stress profile plus five, that's available through this website. I'll also do, for sleep problems, looking at food sensitivities. Food sensitivities are a trigger for sleep problems because adverse food reactions can, again, stress the adrenals and lead to problems that way um, with respect to the body and interfere with, with brain function, melatonin output, or just excess cortisol production. And then finally, one of the tests that I like to do uh, in people who are having sleep problems is looking for parasitic infections. It's, it's interesting how often it comes up that many times people who have chronic sleep problems, it can be due because of some type of chronic intestinal infection that many people don't even know they have. The 401H, which is the gastrointestinal pathogen screen plus H. pylori, so the H stands for H. pylori. Um, this test is available through labtestplus.com and it looks for parasitic infections, bacterial infections, and helicobacter pylori, which is a stomach bacteria that can lead to reflux. So those three tests are critical for anybody with a sleep issue, and I hope that helps you that those can all be ordered through this site at labtestplus.com. Thanks.